All right, so good to see you on this Tuesday morning here. Despite the clouds and the chance for a few light showers today, we're having a great time here in the studio. Hopefully you're waking up in a great mood as well. If not, I'm going to show you the news that will hopefully turn your day around and get you off on the right foot. Here we are 11 minutes after five o'clock. We've got gray overcast skies from our Perrysburg camera here. Temperatures in the mid 60s, so at least it's warm from that perspective this morning. And I've got some really warm days ahead in this forecast. This is what Tiffany wanted to see, so I'm putting it right at the beginning of the forecast and you can see starting on Saturday and Sunday, just in time for your weekend plans. We're turning things around. I was going to reach up into the low 80s for much of next week. A far cry from the cool cloudy weather that's likely to hold for the next couple of days with temperatures only in the upper 60s and low 70s. And if you're curious, when do we typically see our last 80 degree day every single year? Well, we average October 4th, but this year we're likely to go past that with again a big surge of warm weather on the way for next week. Right now we've got clouds, we've got concentrated showers to our north and still an area of low pressure off to our west. That's spinning showers across Wisconsin and that slow moving system is not only responsible for our clouds today, but an uptick in rain chance is very likely for tomorrow. Let's look at this hour by hour forecast now and run it through today. And there you see at times maybe a passing area of heavy drizzle or mist. You probably experienced this yesterday where it's almost an annoying sort of rain. It's not quite really truly raining. But everything is soaking wet because of the drizzle that's coming down. You got to run those windshield wipers from the spray with the vehicle in front of you as well. Could see a similar thing at times today. Now overnight, not much evolves. Our breeze off the lake continues. We've got cloudy conditions. And while it might take most of the day, by the evening hours, here comes that concentrated band of rainfall that's back towards Wisconsin right now and could even lead to a few rumbles of thunder. So cloudy, overcast conditions. The next couple of days going to hold those temperatures down. But then by Friday, we start turning it around, getting at least to the mid 70s, which is about normal for the end of September. And then look at this warm up for next week and along with it, bright sunny skies, almost an exact reversal of what we have right now, starting off this week with cloudy, gray, overcast, cool skies next week, much warmer.